By leveraging the power of the metaverse, healthcare providers are starting to embrace technological innovation head on, and as a result, patients will reap the benefits. With us today is one of the first surgeons in the nation to move his practice to the metaverse, Dr. Adam Shiner. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you so much for having me. Well, starting off first, can you tell us about the power of the metaverse and what it provides specifically when it comes to doctor-patient communication? Sure. Uh, telemedicine right now is very popular, and the metaverse in virtual reality takes telemedicine to the next level. It's actually been used to help with uh, virtual consultations, medical trials, medical training, and many other applications. And how can the metaverse offer new ways for doctors and healthcare providers to interact with patients in these virtual environments? Yeah, interestingly, I'm using it currently right now uh, where I've done virtual seminars uh, for patients there. I have my staff connect with patients in a gallery that we set up in the metaverse. And I've actually had meetings with my staff from their own homes in the metaverse. And focusing more on mental health, how are there treatments out there that could help conditions with this, such as virtual reality therapy or immersive environments designed to promote relaxation and stress relief? Yeah, this is really fascinating. So the metaverse creates a very comforting environment and it helps mental health in general, but has even been proven to help patients with schizophrenia re-engage with society through research that was done in England. With the mental health crisis we have in the US, we all know that there's a need for therapists is great, but how do we create a response that can scale to meet this demand? The singer Jewel started a company called Inner World that brings group therapy and cognitive behavioral um, therapy uh, to the masses. And it's been determined that avatars not being our real selves makes sharing inner thoughts much easier for people, which helps greatly in therapy. Definitely an interesting concept there, and definitely more that they'll wanna know and learn about this. And one of those is including remote surgery training and how surgeons could use the metaverse to remotely perform surgeries or train other surgeons. How is that working? Yeah, we're currently using virtual reality to help train surgeons in orthopedics before they work on real patients. And there's a company called 8Chill that records rare surgeries by expert surgeons, then using AI to recreate that surgery in a virtual world. Upcoming surgeons can then match their hands to the expert surgeon in that virtual world and gain muscle memory and a mental map on how to do that rare, rare surgery. In addition, they now have gloves called haptics that a person can wear that allows a person to feel in the, in the virtual world. And this will allow surgeries to be performed remotely in the future. Technology is ever changing at this point. Excited to see what the future has ahead of us. And if our viewers wanna find out more about this, how can they go about doing so? Sure, there's a link to the virtual world on my website. So if they go to adamshinermd.com, they can get more information about this exciting new world. And as always, we're gonna have a link to Adam's website on our website, fox10tv.com under the Studio 10 tab. But thank you so much for joining us this morning, Dr. Shiner. Thank you so much.